Kevin, a terrific way to end the home schedule for the Whitworth men's soccer team. Uh, Ten goals, 4-1 win over Linfield, 6-2 win over Willamette. Take us back through this weekend and, and what you and this team take out of it. A lot of confidence. Uh, scoring goals was a challenge in a couple of our games early on, uh, but the boys really invested a lot of time, not just uh, in training on their own, coming out early to get some reps in, and it's paid off. Um, Cole's still on his fabulous streak, and uh, actually other players have stepped up, um, seeing that, feeding off his energy, and uh, it's not just a one-person show. We've got players all across our front line and in the midfield that can score goals. Eric Shaporta and Beckett really have come on as of late, and then uh, Caden Martin has uh, added to his tally as well, so... For this group, uh, for this uh, class, senior class, to, to go out uh, with a season like this after some struggles the previous mm -hmm. years, uh, to, to what, how much do you credit this senior class with helping make this step this season? A lot. They have led by example, not just on the training uh, pitch on the field, but also in the way they interact with each other. They check in on the uh, younger players constantly. Um, even though they're off campus, they do spend time together. It's really a very exciting environment to be a part of, uh, both as a staff member and as a player, I think. Uh, you have a chance, if you can get a, a couple of uh, wins on the road this weekend, mm -hmm. to, to, to reach a, a win uh, total that we haven't seen in, in several seasons here at Whitworth. Uh, to what extent is that a, a motivator for this group? Oh, big. Everybody's been talking about trying to get to double-digit wins. Um, but we also realize that uh, with our position, um, people will always come out and try to give us their best game. Um, with the season closing out, we also know that we're on the road. Uh, sure, they're going to have the same kind of senior celebrations we have, and that brings emotion uh, to their team. So we have to just uh, focus on the work and hopefully achieve that goal. What do we know about uh, George Fox and, and Lewis and Clark that will present challenges this time around compared to what we saw in the first time? Both are well coached. Um, George Fox has gotten some results, um, so we're not taking either team lightly this weekend, even though we got positive results against them in the first round. Um, we just have to continue to focus on our game, focus on us, and then adapt to what they, they bring. So.